In this module, we will look at the relationship between development and gender equality, how they are related and how it affects both genders. Development and gender are closely related and linked, interconnected. Equality, as we can understand, is the pathway to equal access of men and women to the means of empowerment or the means of production because these means of production empower people. Also active participation of both men and women in the development process and programs. So when there is gender equality, these things are made possible. We see that girls and women have access to educational and economic opportunities and professional excellence because of increasing equality. Today we see that gradually we are moving towards attaining gender equality. And because of many of such successful efforts, today we see that in most parts we have access, young girls and women, they have access to educational facilities and opportunities. And things are much better than what they used to be decades ago. Women's status and decision-making power is also improving. More and more women are working, more and more women are becoming productive citizens of the society and then they are more and more self-reliant as a re result of the efforts for gender equality. So we see that equality has a positive impact on development in many ways. So if we bring equality, gender equality in the society, how will it be related with the developmental process in the society. For example, the first thing is education. More and more women we see and more and more girls are going to school and the number of women going for higher education is also on the increase because one of the agenda points in the development schemes has been gender equality and women empowerment. Health, maternal mortality is being paid attention to and life expectancy has also increased. Healthcare facilities have improved and healthcare facilities for women have improved and they are much better than what they used to be many years ago. Economy, more women are becoming a part of the active workforce as compared to the past decades. The number of women who are actively contributing to the national economy and the family economy is on the increase. So what can you do to make this process even better and to improve the speed and pace of this progress? A lot of things can be done. A lot of work is required. We know that still not all girls, they have access to schools. Not all young girls are going to school or allowed to go to school. Not all women or young women are allowed to go for higher education or professional education. We also see that in many parts we see, in many regions we see that healthcare facilities are not in a very good shape, especially the facilities that are required by the women. So we need gender equality. Gender equality has a positive impact and positive role in the development process, but still we are lagging behind and there are certain features and certain things which we do not have the way they should be. So what do we need to do? We see that we have to improve the health conditions of women. Maternal mortality rate is uh, much less than what it used to be, but it needs to be uh, worked on. Similarly, access to economic resources and resources and employment and opportunities these things need to be worked on. This means that we can do all these things. It is a responsibility of the society. It is a responsibility of the society. It is a responsibility of the society. And we can see that Qaumi and Bain al-Aqwami NGOs and organizations are also a very important responsibility. If we all take them together and all of them try to get them together, then we will probably get معاشرے میں جنڈر ایکوالٹی یا سنفی مساوات کو زیادہ تیزی کے ساتھ لاسکتے ہیں زیادہ بڑے پیمانے پر لاسکتے ہیں اور اس کا رول اور اس کا کردار 
معاشرے کی ڈیولپمنٹ کے اندر اور ترقی کے اندر بہت نمایاں طور پر ہم اس کو پہلے سے بڑھا کر پیش کر سکتے ہیں اور حالات کو ہم پہلے سے بہتر کر سکتے ہیں اس کا مطلب ہوا کہ ہمیں ایک مشترکہ کوشش کرنے کی ضرورت ہوگی